What I'll do, I'll show you some tools and some frameworks to help you to develop your own strategy. Give you an idea of what's happening in the landscape, what's happening in the industry, and what's happening within your company to help you to develop your own. Are they stupid? Procter & Gamble idiots? Did they overpay $50 billion? <clears throat> no, they bought a brand or a series of brands through Gillette. So when I used to, before I had my midlife crisis and I used to shave, when I used to go into the supermarket and buy, um, buy my razors, I used to buy Gillette because Tiger Woods used Gillette or David Beckham, my hero. <laughs> brands are addictive. One of my best friends is a, is a PhD and he did his PhD on the thing that brands do in your brain, it's similar to what cocaine does in your brain, apparently, or so he'd have you believe. But it's, a very, it's a very addictive thing. He concluded his PhD by saying that maybe brands should have a government health warning because they're addictive. Um, somebody told me once that the, the curve time, if you get a new job, is 18 months, which is a bit scary. Might be true, though. We plot performance or happiness or profit or whatever we want here and then time along the bottom. It's basically saying that when an event happens, things will get better, then things will get really, really shit, and then eventually they'll get better again. I play golf with a couple of guys. One of them's called Dave, and one of them's called John. True story, this is. Dave is Oasis. He was in a band called Oasis 15 years ago. Um, Dave's the, like, the biggest Oasis fan in the world, and he particularly likes Liam Gallagher for some reason. I don't know why bromance going on with the guy or whatever, but he's, he, he really likes him, likes his attitude and the way he dresses like him, talks like him. <laughs> it's bizarre. And um, John, our other best mate, he organises concerts for a living. Amazing. And then Oasis played Wembley and John was in charge of the Wembley concert. So John said to Dave, Dave, you'll never guess what happens. Oasis are going to play Wembley. Do you want tickets? Dave nearly has an orgasm and says, yes. <laughs> um, but not, you don't necessarily need to be a dick if you're in business. You can be a, a decent chap and carry on.